Hello everybody, welcome Hello. back to Britpop's React. Today we've got Tom McDonald for you. Um, so for me, this is first time hearing Tom. I think it is it for you? Uh, yeah, it's, I've sort of heard snippets of him, been oh, yeah. seeing him going around, So, but I've not sat down and listened to him properly. No, okay. So uh, another rapper. Um, we haven't really done too much rap on the channel, so it's always nice to go down that route. We sort of yep. stuck with Eminem. I know we've had... Uh, Oh, Jack Carlo, I think it was. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Twenty four K Golden Juice World. <clears throat> That's the one. Had yeah. a few. Yeah, yeah. A lot a of few. collaborations so far. Yeah. So what's this one about? What's this? Snowflakes. Uh, <laughs> Snowflakes. Yeah, I mean, just looking down the list of um, the names of some of his other songs, you know, Fake Woke, Cancelled, Clown World. Um, yeah, I think he sort of takes some sort of controversial subjects and and raps about them. So. Thomas MacDonald, born September 19, 19, 1988, sorry, Canadian rapper, singer, songwriter, and former professional wrestler. Oh, there you go. Okay. Didn't know that. Uh, didn't know that. He first rose to fame as a rapper after releasing the single White Boy in February 2018. Uh, also released the song Straight White Male, written about MacDonald's belief that the straight white men are being demonized in May 2019. Uh, May 2021, he bought Eminem's NFT uh, for $100,000 and used the instrumental to fuel his Slim Shady inspired track titled Dear Slim, which I think Slim produced, or sorry, Eminem produced. Cool. Non-fungible, right. non-fungible token NFT. Something like Basically that. something digital that's a one-off that you can buy and it seems to be all the craze. Everyone, so, everyone wants a bit. Yeah, we've got these as uh, NFTs. Brilliant. Okay, yeah. let's go. Let's. So, uh, Tom McDonald, Snowflakes. Indeed. If you lie to the government, they'll put you in prison. But when they lie to all of us, it's called being a politician. You think taking guns away will save our kids from the killings? But you're pro choice. Abortion kills way more children. If America's so terrible and racist, it probably isn't safe to encourage immigration. Just saying, all the contradictions are embarrassing. You know who hates America the most? Americans. Trigger warnings used to be on TV for seizures. And now they're everywhere to protect millennials' feelings. He, she, his, him, hers, them, they. Screw a pronoun, cause everyone's a retard these days. We're here I'm preaching at the protest that hatred's the problem. But hating straight men, white folks, and Christians is common. Coca-Cola telling people they should be less white. They preach intolerance, but if you disagree, they fight. There's a race war here, elections based on fear. Black lives only matter once every four years. Soldiers died for this country, and every one of us benefits. Give welfare to the bums and forget about the veterans Black folks and white folks divided by the news But we are all the same, we are red, white and blue Alright, initial reaction then So it's like Eminem but He just jumped straight into The everyday yeah. What's going on around him You know, what I mean, controversial uh, views Yeah, I mean a lot of it is kind of what You know, what we're all sort of thinking really I mean I'd say Eminem does it in a very sort of clever way and, and you know, he's just sort of right. Well, done. I'm just going to say it as it is <laughs> to music. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it is good rapping. I mean, I can follow. Sometimes I struggle with Eminem because he's so yeah. quick. He's so good. He's yeah. so quick. He throws so much information at you so quickly. Your brain has to, you know, interpret that really, really quickly. Whereas yep. uh, with Tom, it's not like that. It seems it's I can I can flow. It's there's a flow to it, and and I can sort of go with it a lot easier than I can with Eminem. Yeah, uh, it was funny that uh, one of the lyrics we were only talking about earlier today. He mentioned sort of Coca Cola, you know, uh, in the news today, um, or it happened yesterday. Ronaldo, the the football player. Uh, attended a press conference and there was two bottles of Coca-Cola on, on the desk and he just picked them up and pushed them out of the way and said, you know, don't drink Coca-Cola, drink water. And I think Coca-Cola lost 2.8 billion overnight by him doing that, wasn't it? It was, you know, right, so yeah. just shows controversial everywhere. It just shows the power of one, one yeah, little One brand moment. as well. Yeah. Yeah. Ashamed to be American? Okay, that's cool. Because honestly, we are all ashamed of you too. Y'all are so fake. Oh no. The forecast said that there be snowflakes. Whoa. You can make us see it your way. 
no way Gasoline and propane More flames, oh no No more snowflakes They set us up to fail, that's what they built the system for Put an ammunition shop across the street from a liquor store Empowering women used to be different than this before The role models got OnlyFans or dance on a stripper pole Screw it, I ain't tripping, I don't mean to be mean But if our children are the future, then our future is bleak They take an Adderall to focus, hit McDonald's to eat They're addicted to phones and they take Xanax to sleep They blurred the lines dividing communism and democracy In 2021, we paint the patriots as Nazis The men playing women's sports get trophies for winning Like great, let's celebrate a man for beating some women If you're black, your life matters, you're supposed to embrace it If you're rich or you're smart, then you're probably Asian If you're gay, then you're brave, all of that I'm okay with But if you're white, the stereotype is you are a racist Blaming capitalism like that's the reason things are tough While you tweet from an iPhone and sip on a Starbucks You're supporting what you stand against, you don't think you are But a Percocet addict don't donate money to pharma Damn dog, we're all afraid to speak the truth And the more afraid we get, the more we hate the ones who do You're ashamed to be American? Okay, that's cool Cause honestly, we are all ashamed of you too Y'all are so fake, oh no The forecast said that there be snowflakes Whoa, you can make us see it your way No way, gasoline and propane There you go, well Yeah, very interesting, very interesting how we how he raps and what he talks yeah. about because uh, they, those are things that maybe you know people think that don't say and, Voice, and voicing, you know, yeah. it, obviously voicing you know certain opinions and certain um certain things so yeah very interesting to see a rapper do that um yeah, and what I, else I mean, he I've, does yeah, um, I think one of the platforms, you know, for, for rap is sort of getting it out there. I mean, if we go way back to when we first started this channel, we did um, Fight the Power, didn't we? Way back, you know. Uh, we did. Remember, oh, yeah, yes, know, so, we did, yes. So, you know, they've been doing it for, for quite a while in rap songs, hip-hop, whatever. I think he's just, you know, he's just taking the subject and, and meeting it head on and saying, you know, what's sometimes we're all thinking but you say anything and it, you get shot down for it so fair mm. play uh, and most of those people are snowflakes <laughs> indeed <laughs> say. more flames oh no no more snowflakes we can all get along but there's no stopping everybody's wrong that's a real problem they don't want to hear it but they still talking soon enough we running out of options this ain't gonna end till it's in the coffin we ain't gonna be friends till we try to squash it I don't know how we can make amends or we drop it Snowflakes melt when it's hot, kid Y'all are so fake, oh no The forecast said that there'd be snowflakes Whoa, you can make us see it your way No way, gasoline and propane More flames, oh no No more snowflakes All right, so there's a introduction to Mr. Tom McDonald. Indeed. Um, did I like it? Yeah, it was good. It was. Uh, would it be on my playlist? Probably not. Um, but the, you know, it was certainly different. You know, rapping about controversial stuff, maybe. Uh, everyday people stuff, a voice, basically. Every day, yeah, yeah. Everyday stuff. Um, I mean, I yeah, I enjoyed it. It was good. It was nice to listen. It was something different for me to listen to. Yeah. Um, so yeah. It was all right. Yeah, you're not really sort of that, that heavily into rap, so I mean, no. you made it through. Um, he's got a, you know, a different rap style um, from what we've kind of seen already with the the Eminem style. His is more sort of machine gun coming at you one after another. This is sort of laid back, slow. Got a deep, you know, quite a booming deep voice actually. Yeah, um, certainly on the but, chorusy bit. Yeah, be interested to see if this is his normal style or if that was just for this song. So maybe we might pick another one out and just you know see see um, see if it's similar or or not. You know, so interesting. Where are you going to go with this one? I would say the fact that I said I like it, but it won't yep. go on my playlist. Yeah, doesn't it? It won't. It doesn't fall in eight or above. So eight and okay. above would go probably into a playlist of mine. So okay. I'd probably give it about a seven point six. Yeah. Okay. Uh, for me, again, I, I do like rap music. I like this 
um, I like this, but again, it was I liked it more because it's sort of coming straight out and saying it as it is without fluffing it all up, you know. Um, but for would I would I listen to it over and over again? Probably not. The, the shock value was listening to it the first time, so yeah, I'm probably going to come in sort of like I say, yeah, seven point eight. All right. Yeah. Seven point seven then. 7.7 7 up there, Tom. 7.7 7 for Tom. I hope you enjoyed our reaction today. Hit that like button if you did. Um, come with us. What else has Tom done? What do you think that might yep. might get that score up into the eights? Hmm. Uh, you know, again, it's just our opinion. It, we're not we're not saying oh that is that score. It's just our our little ears on top of our little brains um, is what we listen but, to and what we give for a bit of fun. Again. Fair play to him. There weren't any sort of shock value lyrics in there. So, I mean... No, uh, not at all, no. We, we're not big on sort of, you know, doing rappers and so on and so forth, but um, a lot of them are kind of sort of all shock value. So, you you know, you give us some other names to, to, to check out and we'll try some, some more rappers out. Yeah, I think we, we enjoy... Uh, like we've enjoyed the Eminem and we and that yeah. one there was nothing wrong with it. It was all right. I mean, I would enjoy that over pot- potentially a rap one that's all about gangster guns, drugs, yeah. and all yeah. the all the things that seem to be sort of stock value. Uh, it's it's just a cookie yeah. cutter. Something yeah. they keep bringing out the same thing, just a slightly different beat and, and different words. So yeah. that's not really my thing at all. That that would go down in in my value. Yeah to go up it needs to be more of a song and a rap and, and, and without just trying to shock yeah we've got one yeah. of those coming up very soon haven't we have we oh yeah oh it was probably out by now Megan oh, oh. <laughs> Stallion yeah <laughs> if you haven't checked that one out go check that one out that's probably oh, one of yeah. our most amazing reactions <laughs> indeed if you are still with us thanks for watching and yes. until next time it's a goodbye from me over there and it's a goodbye from him over there He ain't no snowflake. Snowflake.